<laughs> Welcome back to Chef Plays. I'll probably leave a few of what just happened in. I uh, took a drink of my monster before the last, before I started this episode, and I had to restart my timer because I spent, I felt an air bubble, and I spent like a minute and a half trying to get rid of it, and like it wouldn't go away, and then it just exploded. <laughs> um, and yeah. We are hunting down those shotgun shells. Uh, no, wait, yeah, because I think I'm half tempted just to waste a shot, but at the same time. <sighs> Alright, let's go get that Sonata. And learn how to play the piano by staring at a book cover. <clears throat> because that's how things work. Alright. So, I being that I've never played this, but I have beaten Resident Evil 8 several times, and when you play the piano in that game, it's as simple as you getting a key, but like, this game has thrown so much bogus at me, for all I know, they could pull a Resident Evil 0 and throw a scorpion at me. Oh, that's another one I've beaten. I forgot to say that. When I was talking about the rest of them before, I said I beat 4, 7, and 8, but I have beat 0 once. Um, so let's learn- no, don't push it back, you dingus. Oh, okay, the game pushed it back for me. How sweet. Will you take the musical score? <laughs> you bet your sweet bippy I will. You will bet your sweet bippy I did! <clears throat> Examine. Ha ha ha. Ta-da! Section of the music is missing, leaving only the beginning and the end of the music. Well, wait a minute. Oh, okay, never mind. I, I see what it is. <clears throat> so, it's not necessary to use this now. No, not at the piano. And I can't put it down either. So... Not only do we have to find 30 doors, we now have to find more music, because I wasn't missing enough. Oh man, this game is fun. I'm having a very good time. Are you not entertained? All right. So now we are hunting down armor doors and I don't know... Oh, actually, I think I know where they are. I think they're on the other side of the hall. What I would really like to do... Wait a minute. What if... When I put in... When, well, I have to find the masks first. But what if that door uh, in the basement where like, you hear all the sounds and he's like, I wonder what that could be, even though we've killed 100 zombies at this point. I wonder if, when we put in the four masks, <coughs> if we put in the four masks, if that door to the basement opens up, because I don't, this isn't the room I was thinking of at all. Um, okay, this was, whew, I was a little worried, because I know there's a room somewhere by watching last week's episode. Um, or Friday's episode, that there's a door somewhere, or a room somewhere, with four zombies just kind of doing their own thing. And I do not have the firepower to take out four zombies. I don't want to be out here. I don't trust the outdoors in this game. But, yeah, see? 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 This is... Damn it. I f knew it. I knew it. I should have stayed in. The second I realized I was outside, I should have stayed inside. And now they're gonna come to the windows, and they're gonna wreck my because I had to test fate. Where am I? Wait. Where was that zombie? Where would he have come from? Or is he in here? He is in here! <laughs> I found him. He could stay in there. I want nothing to do with that. Oh, what the hell? Oh, wait, never mind. Who's stinky? 
Ah, I have no more kerosene. Yes. You doing things, Chris? Stun up. Maybe use your knife. You pride yourself on being in the Air Force. Monster kill. 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 Stay back. <laughs> okay. You put up a hell of a fight. Where am I? Oh. What's this? I'm not gonna find a single armor door this episode. I am halfway through it. Damn it! <laughs> I'm halfway through it, and we still have yet to find an armor door. I know there are a ton of them, but apparently... <gasps> I know where one is. I know exactly where one is. So, in the room, it's right next to a save room and upstairs. I am a genius. Ah, hell yeah, what is this? I left some bullets in the room on the right. I'll go ahead and look for a way out. Wesker's a liar. I don't know how many of you have seen the movies or the rest of the games, but Wesker's a piece of shit. Where did all this come from? I take back my statement. Wesker's a good guy. What? It... Hold on, I'm gonna drop in a clip real quick of a previous episode because I'm almost damn near certain none of this was here before. Sick. Sick. But I'm also very, very blind. So I could be very, very wrong. But I don't think it was. Yeah, I'm gonna take that. Oh man, that just made my day. About half the kerosene still remains. Refill your canteen. Yes. Man, I don't know what happened, but our luck just flipped. Like, on a dime. I'm gonna put this away because it has nothing to do with my life. <clears throat> Maybe that's why he wasn't using his knife. Oh, wow. I, uh, put it away. That's good. I'm doing good. <clears throat> Damn. I kind of want to put the shotgun and the shells away and go get the rest of the shells. Because that will put us at 12, 13. <clears throat> and I'm going to reload it super lazily. Because I don't have time to goof around. I mean serious business. <clears throat> we'll put that away. I'm not going to carry any of these on me because... Okay, I'm going to use that one. But... I immediately regret using that. I forgot that they, like, heal you from pretty much death. Um, but that's okay, you know? We're definitely saving. Because I may not have made a ton of progress, but <clears throat> not only do we have the ink ribbons to pull something like that off, it's an old typewriter. Uh, we have, um, uh, oh yeah, that, that was my whole point. We have enough to pull it off. <clears throat> Damn. Losing my voice. Save. Thank you. Alright. We'll put that back. And there is an armor door right upstairs. So we will put this away. And we will go and unlock that door. And probably get attacked. And then we'll quit. And we will never play again. But that's a lie, because I'm having a genuinely good time playing through this game. Aww. This door... Where's the door? Oh. <clears throat> I did not use the mansion key. I have no mansion key. <laughs> Wait. Never mind. I think it's calling the armor key a mansion key. <gasps> ah! Beautiful. I am so happy. And there's three doors! I could not be happier. I am almost willing to put money on the fact that one of these doors unlocks a door from the other side of an area that I've been in before. Almost willing to put money on it. <clears throat> so how this works is you combine these and that has the same like healing abilities as uh, the first aid spray. So it's really powerful. It's locked. It's an old fashioned lock that's rather simple. So there's an old key somewhere. That's good to know. Where does this door take me? Is this an old key? 
<laughs> All right. What's this? You can't carry any more items. These footprints look like they're headed straight through the bed. What? What are you talking about? Is there more? What's this? Ink ribbons? There's something over here. Is there not? Aha! So here's what we're gonna do. We're at our minute mark, our 11 minute mark. Um, so we will go to the safe room real quick. Uh, drop in. Um, actually, how far back was the safe room? But we will drop in an item or two so we can go get that first aid kit thing. Oh yeah, we're not super far from the safe room. Uh, we will drop something in there. We will grab our that med kit, and then we will uh, stop the episode. So I feel like we're we're making more progress doing the little things than I was making trying to do like constant big moves in this game. How much how much space do I get in this thing? Because okay, you know what? There's a little thicker on the side. There's no way I'm gonna need this much space. That's a lot of storage. I was genuinely worried I was running out. Huh. It's still going. Up. I wonder how many spaces that is. Alright. I'm getting distracted. Let's go use that old key. No. We won't use the old key. We'll pick up the first aid thing, leave the episode, and then we'll start a new episode. And that's where we're going to leave off. On a nice little cliffhanger. I guess... You know, I guess since this is a playthrough, if you think about it, the end of every episode is technically a cliffhanger for you guys, because I don't have to wait 24 hours to see what happens next, except for on Friday. No, I have to wait a full week to see what happens next. You guys are lucky. What does that thing even do? Examine. First aid box. No kidding. What do you mean there's nothing? Can I now open it? It's not necessary. Alright, well, thank you for watching. I hope you had a good day, and you have a good rest of your day if you're watching this while there's still sun out, uh, which there might be, depending on when I upload it. Um, you can't tell me what to do.